Hello everybody, welcome back to another What's New Wednesday. So this week we are heading back to Marks and Spencer. It's that time again. I think there's like a little theme. Every six weeks when we take the dog to have his hair cut or his fur cut, um, we go to Whiteley Shopping Village and have a little mooch around Marks and Spencer. So it's that time again and they've started to get some autumn wear in there. So it's quite a small little come shop with me, but I'm just going to show you a few bits and bobs that I saw in there ready for the autumn winter. So I hope you enjoy. Let's cut to the shop and then I'll show you what Chris bought from the food hall when we get back. Let's have a look. Oh, we're starting. We're starting to get autumn. Already I'm loving. I do like this, like snake print. Shirt dress, what have we got over here? Oh, it's a train that. <laughs> Brown. This is nice. Oh, this is so soft. Oh, I really like this jacket. What have they got here? Is that called a jumper? That's nice. Oh, they've got the shirt as well as the dress in this snake print. I mean, they've still got summer, don't get me wrong. They've still got quite a bit of summer. Yeah, but autumn's coming. I am liking this colour palette. Crisp white shirt, olive green trousers. Oh, they're wide leg. And the leather jacket. Oh, this is the same one as the brown one. So soft. Oh, Chris, the jumpers without sleeves are back. You've missed them. It's a tank top, I know. I know. Aha, this is the kind of map. Oh, oh, that's a bit wobbly. Uh, yeah, but I want a longer one, I think. I think that's a bit too short. It's not. It's not that short on me. I don't know. I mean, I'm not, not size 10. Not, not today, anyway. Oh, this quilted bag's nice. It's got compartments and a zip. Oh, I like this dress. Oh, I really like that. Oh, it's long. Oh. Is it? Look at that, doesn't it? Through the light, look. Oh, okay. Got some sort of line in there. Yeah. Oh, look. Thank you, got Kwan. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I like the fact that it's V-neck. And is that stretchy in the middle? Yes, it is. Could, you, could that be like a transitional piece? You could wear that with brown, like brown boots and a brown cardigan and a brown belt. I think that would work. A blazer's gonna be a big thing again for autumn. I have many a blazer in the wardrobe, which I think I might crack out again. Blazers and dresses. Oh, this is a, this is an unusual dress. This is really high in the body. I don't, I don't quite, hmm, oh, stripy knits and jeans, actually that's, that's a really nice, nice jumper, I can, yeah that's really nice actually, oh they have got a lot of summer stuff on set, a load of it. Wow, oh my God. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh, if only they had these in a size seven. I kind of love those. Oh, shorts. Oh, bags. Sunglasses. Oh, this color's nice. They got here. Oh, I like that shirt. The padded jackets are out now. Quite like that colour. I like the off-white one as well. That's quite nice. They've got the gilet. Oh, this is really light. 
Oh, that's perfect, like dog walking wear. You know, when it's still, it still looks that's thicker, but you know, when it's still a bit warm, you don't need a coat to take the dog for a walk. I quite like this powder blue. Powder blue? Corn flower blue? Corduroys are out. Red corduroy. Do you know what? These would look nice at Christmas with a white jumper, like a white fluffy jumper. I think they'd look really nice. They've got these plum ones, navy. Now the question is, are they starting to get the boots out? Yes, they are. Look at these. Like cowboy boots. And then boots. I love boot time. These look very comfortable. Do you know what? My mum gets boots from Marks and Spencer every year and swears by them. She says they are the most comfortable. She gets ones that are like fluffy inside. I'm thinking I might treat myself to a pair this year. And Chelsea boots. I like this style. They go with my dresses. Oh, these high ones are nice and they're stretchy at the back. So if you're a bit wider on the old calf, they haven't really got many handbags. They're more sort of going out bags, really. And you've still got a little bit of summer stuff. Oh, what's this one? That's nice. That's is that like a jeep for the Christian jewel? I think so. Anyway, I've lost Chris. He's gone into the food hall. So let's go and have a little look. See if we've got any autumn food. These are my ultimate favourite trifles in Marks and Spencer. They usually do a big one, but I don't think they do them anymore. Oh, he's at the till. I wonder what he's bought. And we're back and already I'm thinking about that leather jacket. It was so soft. I wish you could have felt how soft it was and I keep thinking about it. Anyway, without further ado, I'm gonna make this very quick because the battery's flashing on my camera. As I said that sentence, the battery died and the spare battery is charging upstairs at the moment and I want to film this now so I can edit it. Um, so we're back on the phone, so anyway. Without further ado, what did Chris buy from the food hall? He bought me a trifle, but not only that, he bought me a yellow sticker trifle. So it was reduced from £2.10 to £1.30. So that's what I'm having for pudding tonight. And Chris and Mum are having, um, these are also yellow sticker, <laughs> reduced from £4 to £2.50 for mini sticky toffee loaf cakes. They look nice actually. They do look nice, but I'm not really, I don't really like, I don't really like a lot of cake, if I'm honest. I like carrot cake and chocolate cake, but that's about it. Uh, and then, if I can get it out, he bought, I love these. These are the cheese loaves. So these are West Country Extra Mature Cheddar and Red Leicester loaf. And you got it sliced. It smells so good. So, good. so you got a little cheese loaf of bread and some pudding for tonight so that's that's everything anyway i hope you enjoyed having a little look around and seeing what they've got in marks and spencer this time around and they're starting to get some autumn bits in there so yeah it's not going to be long it's not going to be long anyway i will see you guys in my next video take care and i'll see you soon